end the corporal punishment. This is a message from Secretary Cardona. Corporal punishment is still a practice in 23 states where it causes physical and mental harm to our students. Corporal punishment especially is causing mental illness. It can be depression, anxiety, you know, these are the experiences they're having after corporal punishment compared to those students who do not go through corporal punishment. So corporal punishment it can cause also domestic violence because these kids believe that problems can be solved with corporal punishment, with problem, corporal punishment and aggression. This is what they learn from corporal punishment. So Secretary Cardona is calling states department of education to stop corporal punishment in their schools this this is the practice that we see especially in boys colored uh, colored minority communities especially um black african americans and other colored people and also disability disabled uh, members of our students so secretary cardona is saying that this is specifically affecting this minority communities boys are twice affected compared to their same age group in white community girls are four times affected compared to their white girls this is affecting colored people, colored students in the schools. It is also affecting their cognitive development. Cognitive development is the verbally or non-verbally compared to their way to their white age group. Colored people who went through corporal punishment are experiencing delayed cognitive development. So corporal punishment has to stop in these schools. What he also states is that corporal punishment should be substituted with positive reinforcement, encouraging good behavior, encouraging with rewards, with positive, you know, encouragements verbally and also rewarding them and also discouraging negative behavior. This is the good discipline method. That's what we know. But it is hard in the schools to implement positive reinforcement, but it's possible. So Secretary Cardona is stating that this corporal punishment have to be outlawed, have to be condemned in schools because it's not helping our students, it's not helping our young, you know, educated population because when they grow up, they can be aggressors and domestic violence could be cause of corporal punishment. This is the message from Secretary Cardona.